Good morning to all. Welcome to my presentation. Today our topic is waxing and waning of moon. Let us see the different phases of moon. These are the different phases of moon and we will know about how it affects in our practical life. Let us learn about our topic. What is waxing and waning of moon? Waxing Waxing of moon means the moon is getting larger in the sky, moving from the new moon towards full moon. I think you all are familiar with new moon and full moon. Vanning Vanning means the moon is decreasing in size and moving from full moon towards the new moon. These are the different phases of moon that I seen you the uh, previous slide. Why does the moon have phases? Do you even think that? The revolution of the moon around the earth causes the moon to appear to have phases. When the moon is closest to earth, it is about 2,21,463 miles away. Like Earth, the moon rotates on its axis. Unlike Earth, the moon takes approximately 29 days to complete one rotation. The Eight Phases of Moon there are eight phases of moon. Last quarter of moon, vanning gibbous moon, full moon, waxing gibbous moon, first quarter half moon, waxing crescent moon, new moon, vanning crescent moon. Let us see the videos. The moon is changing its face slowly and slowly. It is now full moon. Moon is changing its face from full moon to new moon.
Now the moon is half moon. Let us see the next video. Now we can move to further more slides. The influences of moon phases in practical life. The moon have different influences in our life. The moon have existed and exercises a magical attraction on us. The moon which sets Enormous masses of water in motion and so causes flood in the sea. It is also the common knowledge that the menstruation cycle in women 
keep peace with the lunar cycle we know that there is a relationship between the tides and moon so it can affect all the kinds of liquids in earth it may affect fisheries agricultures and health conditions there are two types of tides spring tide when the moon is full or round the gravitational pull of the moon and sun are combined at this time the high tides are very high and low tides are very low this is known as spring tide next is neap tide During the moon's quarter phases the sun and moon work at right angles causing the bulges to cancel each other the result is smaller difference between the high and low tides and is known as neap tide let us learn about the influences of moon phases in fisheries Every fisherman knows that the best fishing time are when the fish are feeding. This tend to be during the dawn or dusk. But what often goes under notice are the two periods elsewhere in the day: the moon rise and moon set. Influences of moon phases in fisheries. Because of the moon has effect on variety of factors surrounding the fish including the life of the they hunt this spirit combined with the moon phases are what trigger feeding You can read all the further slides it is all about the influences of moon phases in fisheries Now we can learn about the influences of moon phase in agriculture. In this section we can learn about the influences of moon phases in health zone in human beings If I am speed you can pause the video to read the slide contents Now we can learn about the influences of moon phases in animals Moon is a gift of God. Above all other planets, the moon is most apprehensible. Most farmers throughout the world take the moon into account their work consciously or unconsciously. Thank you for watching my slide. I think you learn all about the moon and its contents